But what a night it was in the women's weightlifting here in Tokyo last night. And as you say, a, a first GB medal for women's weightlifting. And I'm delighted to say that Emily Campbell, who won that medal, is with us here in Tokyo on the rooftop of the GB base. Emily, how are you feeling? That was just such an intense night for women's weightlifting last night. Yeah, no, definitely. I mean, it's, you know, essentially history making and uh, I was just so glad to be a part of it you know us girls have came out and you know performed out of our skin you know all top eight finishes and then obviously to top it off with a medal is is fantastic and yeah I'm just over the moon I'm really happy with the way the performance went it you know it didn't all go to plan but you know uh, that's the way that sport is um, but you know it's the result that always counts. Just lift that medal up for us and tell us what that means because you're not lot lottery funded you've had to kind of get to Tokyo the hard way and the people of Nottingham have helped you to get here, oh yeah, this this means everything, and this is definitely a lot sweeter knowing that you know you, all the trials and tribulations you had to go through to get to get where I am today. And I'm just so thankful for every single person that's been a part of my journey. You know, a lot of my support staff that I work with, you know, work with me on a sponsored basis or work with me for free. Um, you know, so my nutritionist, my physiotherapist, all of that. You know, without them guys, I would not be where I am today. And then, you know, down to the bags of fruit, I get off the market and the cobbler's sorting out my boots. You know, every single person contributed to me getting this last night. And, you know, I couldn't, can never ever repay you all. We saw, of course, in your weightlifting final last night, Laurel Hubbard as well, the New Zealand weightlifter, the first trans individual competitor in the Olympic Games. What is your thought this morning on just what she has done for women's weightlifting? I mean, it's brought a lot of attention to the sport and I hope that now people come back to the sport and just watch it because they love weightlifting. Um, I hope that I put on a good enough show last night to show that, you know, people, ex weightlifting is exciting and it's great to watch and it's really intense and it brings you a roller coaster of emotions. And, you know, if girls and boys out there watch that last night and want to pick up a barbell, please go and do it. There's ways of doing it. Hit the British Weightlifting website. We'd love to have you all. And the more lifters we can get, the better. So thank you. And final thought, Emily. I know that you've said previously that you've been doing this to show what plus-size women can do in sport and how important that is. Tell me about what you see as, uh, as what you achieved last night in, in that respect. Yeah, definitely. I mean, you know, I don't look like a typical athlete. I don't have the typical athlete body, but, you know, what my body does is amazing. So, you know, I want to prove that it doesn't matter what you look like, what size you are, how much you weigh. You know, if you want to achieve something in sport, if you put your mind to it, you can. And I hope that I proved that last night. Emily Campbell, silver medalist. Congratulations. Thank you so much for talking to us Thank live. Thank you.